Now technology, when made easy, we can put it to work together. And these next generation small loaders are packed with automation to just work. Now let's take a closer look at that auto engine. So default out of factory is gonna be auto, but you can come in and change it. You can see automatic. And when I'm in automatic, what we're gonna do is if I go to maximum engine RPM, which I've done now, you're limited at just 1600 revolutions per minute. But if you pull max implements, boom, it shot up to 1800 for me and partial implements, back to just 1600 and if i don't ask for a command it's going to go to an idle mode of just 800 rpm power when you need it efficiency when you don't now as we come further across auto wheel torque factory default we're going to find that perfect balance of wheel torque so it's got maximum push without burning the rubber off the machines now a few other things of note optional joystick steering you talk about beautiful technology this is a force feedback system up to 25 mile an hour capable. The faster you go, the stiffer this gets to make it very safe and controllable. Really nice option for those repetitive cycles. Also, our implement joystick, they're programmable. So all of the buttons along the joystick you can change. So if you come into your screen, you come into your machine, you scroll down to advanced settings in this example, you can change all of the joystick settings that you want to make this machine yours. Nice, simple, easy to use, set it up, put this technology to work for you. Now talk about technology made easy, CAT payload is gonna be standard equipment with 250 hours of demo on these next gen small loaders. So through the screen, fully integrated, I can come over to my CAT payload screen and I at a glance can see over the last five passes, somebody threw 12 and a half tons and I can actually store that payload as work done and then it's gonna spit out a ticket for me. So as optional equipment, we do have a CAT printer, you can see exactly how much payload this next gen loader threw right through that screen. There's 50 different operator profiles which can be programmed in this machine. You jump in it, you punch in your code, and it returns it the way you want it. So a couple settings that you can customize. The powertrain feel. As we come in here, we can adjust the feel of the powertrain. You talk about cool technology made easy. You can make this machine roll like a torque converter, aggressively start and stop like a traditional high stat, or a brand new innovative mode, what we're calling single pedal mode. You can lock the throttle and through just your right foot, you can adjust your ground speed. The more you push it, the faster you go. If you have a panic and you get off all the pedals, it comes to a full stop. This is simplified operating mode for those of you jumping into a wheel loader for the first time. You can also, depending on what you've got on the front end, customize your attachments. So into the attachment setting, we can do three different attachments which are easily recalled. And behind that, you can set the implement response, you can set the auxiliary flow, you can set the kickout so that you're set up for that individual task. Really cool technology as standard in these next gen small loaders.